In today's video, I'm gonna teach you how to add domains to the allow list in Google Workspace. Whether you're a small business owner or an IT manager, understanding how to manage your email security settings is crucial for smooth and secure communication. Adding trusted domains to your allow list ensures that emails from these domains don't get falsely marked as spam. Let's dive in and walk through these steps together. First, we'll need to begin by navigating to Google Workspace. This is where all the magic begins. Once you've reached Google Workspace, look for the admin console. This is your central hub for managing various settings related to your organization's Google services. If you're not already logged in, you'll be prompted to do so. Make sure you use your business email credentials to gain access. Once you're logged in, direct your attention to the top right corner of the screen where you'll find the Google Apps menu. This menu provides access to all the Google services available to your account. Clicking on this menu will reveal a multitude of options, and the one we want is the admin icon. It's represented by a gear icon which symbolizes settings and control. Pretty fitting, right? Next, head over to the account section. This is where all the organizational settings reside. At this point, you'll start seeing options related to managing your domains. Our next stop is the domain section. Clicking here will take us one step closer to achieving our goal. Within domains, look for the allow listed domains option. Entering this section enables you to add domains that you trust and ensure their emails don't get mistakenly categorized as unsolicited mail. After clicking on allow listed domains, you should now see an option to add domain. Clicking on add domain will prompt you to input the domain you wish to allow list. Now simply type in the domain name that you want to allow list. Take care to enter the domain correctly as any typos could lead to incorrect configurations and emails still getting misclassified. Once you've typed in the desired domain, proceed by clicking on the add button. This indicates your confirmation to include this domain in your allow list. The final touch is to click on save. This action solidifies all the adjustments you've made and applies them to your workspace settings. And there you have it, you've successfully added a domain to your allow list in Google Workspace. By doing this, you've not only heightened the efficiency of your email system, but you've also ensured a smoother communication flow within your organization. Remember, regularly reviewing your allow list can help maintain optimal email security. Thanks for following along, and I hope you found this guide helpful.